Hey Earthbound Army, hope everyone's having a fantastic day, night, noon, wherever it is in your part of the world. Now in my last previous videos, I did an update on Mintable and I kind of described the clunky process of, of selling an item and an NFT artwork on Mintable. And after someone wins your bid, there was kind of no indication of what to do next. Uh, you know, how do you know it's been transferred? How do you know that they've paid and all that good stuff? So in this video, I want to show you how you can verify that um, one of your NFT artwork has been transferred and how you can check that they've paid. Okay, so first things first, you wanna log into your account and click my profile. You wanna go into my NFTs, okay? And once you go in, it will tell you the address, your Ethereum wallet address. You wanna copy that because you're gonna need that code to then go into etherscan.io, which is the scanner for the Ethereum blockchain. With the scanner, it will tell you every transactions that have happened on the Ethereum blockchain. And because Mintable uses Ether, then that's what we're using to check whether this transaction has gone through. So you copy that, right? And then you paste your address ID and you click search. It should show you everything that has occurred on your address ID. Everything meaning the transactions that have occurred through that Ethereum address. Now, because the ERC721 token is an NFT artwork, you have to click ERC721 link here. And it'll show you that two days, 15 hours ago, a transaction occurred. You wanna click that hash ID. And I don't claim to be professional in crypto, so all this stuff is just, you know, just random codes to me but there is a way that you can determine whether uh, it is your NFT artwork that was transferred. Now, also take note that the value amount, $10.71, well, at the time of the transfer, he transferred 1071 and like I said in the other video, Ether is dynamic, so the currency does change and fluctuate a little bit. Now, what you wanna do is go into my NFTs and then click more information. You will see a token ID here, okay? And you wanna copy that number you want to go back into ether scan you want to press ctrl f paste that and then you, you're looking for that token id and here you see the token transferred that's the same token id that was transferred so it was transferred from my ethereum address to i assume the buyer the winning bidders ethereum wallet and it says from my wallet to the other individual person's wallet for an erc721 token id which is the nft so all nft uh, items are minted on the erc721 um, smart contract token so there you go that's how you find out that it's been successful um, obviously, you can always go into your MetaMask and see if all of a sudden there's been a jump or an increase in the amount that you have in your wallet. But I asked the dev that and I said, look, I didn't really see a jump in my balance, but he said it's likely because it was just su such a low price. I only sold it for $10.80. Mintable takes a 5% cut commission for making it gasless and, and obviously selling it on their platform. So. It's fine. This was just a test anyway. It was good to experience that whole process of putting up an NFT and putting up for auction and being successful. Hopefully that was of some value. That is how you can check whether an NFT that you created has been successful in transferring and also you being able to receive the money from the winning bidder. If you uh, got something out of the video, please drop a like and uh, I'll see you in the next video.